Welcome to episode four of Acquisitions Incorporated Series Two. Are you ready for more adventure? Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Good time. <sighs> adventure. Bring it on. I've been waiting all day. Well, then let's get right to it. Mike, I believe oh. you have a recap for us on what happened I last do. time. I do. I remember everything that happened last time. In full detail. Yes. Each uh, death. So we were transported to a new, a new level, and this one was breaking apart. Uh, it was being destroyed. You could see down below uh, stars. That was, that was all. And uh, we were able to hop across this big chasm thanks to some feather fall and a rope. All worked out great. Um, there was a tomb over there. Oh, no. First thing that happened, a beholder tried to come in. And then the portal that it was coming through closed before it even got through, which happens, I guess. And yep. these tentacles <laughs> fell down. Yeah. And you'd think that the tentacle by itself would be inert, right? And fun. And fun mm -hmm. to play with. Mm -hmm. Tentacles are great. <laughs> but they're not. <laughs> Rays are firing out of these things all the time. So we fucked around with these eye stalks for a while. Bobby got paralyzed. I did. Yeah. Uh, no, Omen almost died. Yeah. Literally the death I, ray. Oh, a literal it. death ray, but I, I did manage to roll a good roll for once. Yeah. I had an idea to try to put them in a bag. It didn't. <laughs> there was no good way to work with these no, eyes. No, no, no matter what we tried to do with them, they started to shoot out. And then also, because you're Gem Dark Magic, yeah. and you're Evil and Marthane, but Gem Edition, mm -hmm. um, sometimes the beams would shoot into the, your crystalline form. And yeah. then they would shoot all the rest of mm -hmm. us. Whoops. And so that was, I mean, that was also That unpleasant. wasn't the best. I was trying to be noble. Chris is yeah. mean, is, is the takeaway. Mm -hmm. We found no. a tomb where they bury uh, people and their weapons. And uh, certainty mm -hmm. was cool like was cool to the person who was dead yeah. and the weapon. <laughs> yeah. And so the weapon came along. Bobby grabbed it. It's a big pick uh, that is a, also can talk to him. Chippy. Chippy. And it has a German accent, so warm up on yeah. your it sounds German like consonants. Yeah. Uh, and then, uh, oh, we saw a room that had a bunch of dead dwarves in it. Their brains had been taken out by a brain collecting spider bug. Yeah. Um, <laughs> that killed me twice. Uh, one of the, the second time, felt a little weird because there were like three people between me and the spider thing that it was personal like at that the point, beam had to avoid <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. i don't know how that worked can we uh, talk about where you died though well i died on my i have a crying rock i had a crying rock in the other level mm -hmm. that i like to cry on i like to die on right um, mm -hmm. omen and, you, and you, me. you stuck in there you stuck yeah. in there uh, uh, omen, oh and also omen has changed his technique slightly so now he is no longer claiming that we are a part of a sort of magical multiverse, uh, you know, adventure theater, visceral, you know, takes place. Take, let's get theater, you know, out of the theater, right? Mm -hmm. Give me some realization. Uh, yes. After he died the second time, I felt like maybe I needed a new tack. So the new scenario is this: I have told Jim that I am from the future, <laughs> and that I know that he becomes a great wizard. But in order for that to happen, he has to do everything that I say for the next ten to twenty years. And so far, it seems to be working. Well, he you... told me something from the future that I didn't know. Oh, yeah, the tur donut. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a <laughs> donut that has another donut okay. inside of it. Yeah, that they make in the future. Yeah. I bought it. And, and I am impressed that Omen did sort of tell the truth. Yeah. Because you are, in fact, from the future. No, he doesn't know that he, he doesn't think of it that yeah, way. Yeah, I didn't, yeah. Um, and, and if he had known that he had told the truth, he would be ashamed right away. <laughs> but. But anyway, I'm sorry, please. Uh, we killed the spider thing. Evelyn and Bobby beat the shit out of it, caught it on fire. Mm -hmm. um, breathed acid on it. Breathed mm -hmm. acid on it. Yeah, that was crazy. Oh my God, Bobby rolled three sixes in a row. The number mm -hmm. of the beast. Yeah. <laughs> the damage dealt was halved. It was nine damage, which they tell me is the number of Asmodeus. Right. Yeah. Uh, and then after that, we, oh, we saw this other room over here that had a, a magic fire in it after we put a coin in. And they all stuck shit in there, mm -hmm. and it and caught on fire. It's hot. And I stuck my shit in there, and it like burned up. Cause this was really like not liking me. Dude, it was an act of it was, it was yeah. hours and hours of the most hideous aggression. What yeah. was going on? My shit caught on fire, and I had to like put it out. Yeah. Everybody else got a magic weapon. Not you. No. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and then we picked out the chunk that we needed. Everybody got uh, the headache and teleported. Chris said, you all get a long rest, and he left. Mm -hmm. 
Did he actually say you had a long rest? Well, actually, you won't be able to finish a short rest. So, so get you. you get nothing. I, I remember something about it. I remember he said, long. Time to rest. Yeah, feel, it was Jasmine, time. did you say long rest? Long, didn't he say? Yeah, he, he, say he did say like you, you, you closed your eyes yes. and went, you opened them after a long time, and I feel like that. It's like you feel refreshed. Like there's something. <laughs> there's the implication. <laughs> the snort. It's I mean, about, the, it's about the implication. Yeah, exactly. Nobody fucking back if me you up. Close your, if you close I was trying eyes, to give Jasmine them. the opportunity we to, to pay you that. back. Yeah. Yeah, no, I was selling it until you snorted. <laughs> <laughs> no. It, it, it came from deep within. But anyway, yeah, so full HP. Yes, and, um, spell slots um, back. <laughs> no, I don't think so. I, my guess is that it's a really important to them that we don't rest, suffer, yeah. Yeah. perpetually, and thus far they've they've managed. Let's it. find out. Maybe well, we're wrong. It's, here's my question. Yeah. Does nothing in Greyhawk have experience yeah. <laughs> appointed to it? No. Like that's a great question. We like the first the, episode one. I was like, okay, we didn't kill anything. Fair play. I was two. I was, we've killed. Seconded. A Motion brain approved. spider, I, yeah. quivering brain spider, and technically, I would argue, half of a boulder. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, 50%. <laughs> 50 percent. And that like the bad thing parts. that came out, and the ooze the that came and out. The worst parts. Yeah. yeah. And, and also, milestone wise. And also, even got a bunch of goo on her from a hole. Oh yeah, yeah. Hole that's gotta be worth on. something. Hole goo, yeah. 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 That was a butt. I came out of the bubble. And it was real wet. In there. Yeah, it was super wet. So that's yeah. probably yeah. two levels right there. And anyway, just. Consider you, and especially with the experience, every time we attempt to take a short rest, something happens. Yeah, yeah. so it just yeah. does seem like that would give us even like maybe like one point two times the experience, something some sort of more. Like we're playing yeah. on nightmare mode. Night, yeah, nightmare, nightmare mode. mode. This is exactly maximum difficulty yeah. permadeath. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's at least two times. Well, yeah. We yeah. Permadeath. I mean, it's we, so yeah, I guess we did yeah, a couple times. Um, <laughs> It's so cute how we think this is going to work. No. I mean, we... <laughs> <laughs> but I'm enjoying it. Yes. <laughs> it's like, oh, I don't have to eat dinner. What, what, would you like a pony with that, too? <laughs> so that high-pitched sound <laughs> goes through your mind again as you leave that place that was falling apart, mm -hmm. surrounded by strange glimpses of stars, and... As your vision comes back into focus and that high-pitched sound subsides, you find yourselves inside a room oh. with no windows and no and doors. No doors. <laughs> the room appears to be growing. Is this haunted room actually <laughs> stretching? <laughs> or is it your imagination? And it's funny you mention that. Uh-oh. Oh, no. <laughs> because you see that it does appear to be getting taller. The walls seem to be stretching. Really? And a amethyst light suddenly illuminates the room, and I need everyone to make a constitution saving throw. I've been on oh, this boy. ride before. It's fun. We're still by blessed by Asmodeus, though, right? You do not. You do not feel the Blessed. infernal blessing okay. still present. You said Constitution saving. Time? Yeah. Yes. Oh, Same. nineteen twins. Yay! We we're dying twins. Mike? Ooh, look at that. I got a six. You doing well? That's well. I got a fifteen. All right. In. I rolled a nineteen good. for uh twenty one. Twenty two. So. Omen and Jim what? immediately fall to the ground and appear to be fast asleep. In fact, they're both snoring very loudly. Sounds like a long rest, baby. <laughs> <laughs> How many spell slots do I get back? <laughs> we'll find out in a minute. <laughs> the three of you, you manage to ward off the wave of sleep that hit your two companions. And so what that means is instead of falling asleep, you have this irresistible urge to just sit on the ground and ponder your situation. Mm. And you see that this room appears to be an elevator 
going oh, down. Okay. And the flash of amethyst light that knocked them out and that sort of puts you into this awake stupor is then followed by a green flash of light. You two do not have to make a saving throw, but the three of you green do. Flame. I actually have a point of order. Magic can't put you to sleep because you and I are the same race. Yeah, but this is a special type of magic. <laughs> <laughs> what, what? An omen, you go and you wake up, realizing you, you yes, should have uh, fallen no, asleep. Wait, 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 uh, Jeremy, I've got a 10 for the green light save, and I know that it's good. It feels like a good 10. Like a high 10. <laughs> Solid. <laughs> what did everyone else get, 13. other than Jim? Yeah, I'm snoring. Mm -hmm. I rolled a 17 plus 3 is dirty 20. I rolled a 1, so very close to my yeah. father. Mm -hmm. and yeah, it, like, it's, that's, that's a, it's Sig a figs. Family, family business. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Land on the front When one looks at the significant figures, a one really is kind of a ten yeah. in some regards. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Eye of the beholder. And what did you get? Thirteen. Thirteen. Ouch. Oh, no. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, Evelyn, you see the three of them uh, all scream out in pain. You're not sure why, though. You see them all flinch. The three of you all feel like you just got engulfed by green flame. Green, green flame. flame! And you each take nine fire damage. Oh, you're oh. Uh oh. Hell yeah. <laughs> that was like but he doesn't. He He's does sleeping. not. He's sleeping. Should have gone to sleep. Dude. We should have gone to Chasing sleep. Chasing a rabbit. <laughs> yeah. And the rabbit is not made out of fire. Yeah. I said nine. Yeah, nine. It's a regular rabbit. Yeah, I'm just like. <laughs> then <laughs> the legs are gone. The elevator starts to speed up, oh. and then there is a red flash of light. And the four of you who are awake, you have to make a, another Constitution saving throw. I miss my aura so bad. It was a good aura. Twelve for a fifteen. Mm, Nineteen. What kind of save is this? Con again. Con again. That's an 11. Uh, four. <laughs> All right. Bobby and Evelyn, you both resist it. Uh, but the drums, uh, the... What you two see is seeping out of the walls. There is this wave of blood that starts to pour into the room. What? And, it's always blood with this guy. And <laughs> it forms up into a figure, and you see standing in front of both of you, your sister Portentia. Oh shit! The, the rest one, of the you. The one I. Wait, oh. The rest yeah. of you do not see this, but you see the two of them looking transfixed at a spot in space, and she looks at the two of you. I am so disappointed in both of you. You're my little sister. Like, you can't be disappointed. That's not how it works. You stopped me from ruling the Sword Coast. Yeah, I mean, that. no, that is true. Honestly, she's got us there. I mean, you were, you had a ship full of blood samples. You were... Tenti, it was super villain shit. I mean, honestly, you your your reach, you know, exceeded your grasp on this. I mean, I, I'm not past a hostile acquisition, or I'm a businesswoman myself, but... Absolutely. Some of Absolutely. the stuff you were trying to pull, it, it crosses it, over It was a lie. Public image. Right. We it, share a last name. Right. I, I can't deny it was a big play. Yeah. yeah it was I a huge mean, play. Yeah. And they talk again. Evelyn's like behind, like standing right where gotta, they're looking. And we have, and to, to, we like, have to give her that. You shot for the moon. Exactly. Um, glass ceilings exist to be broken. Absolutely. And that's actually very well put. 
In Are this you case, okay? you know, maybe we were the glass ceiling. We're great. Yeah, so, we're yeah. great. We're great. Okay. We're, we're just talking to Portentia. Uh, yeah, Evelyn. Having a conversation. Uh, Portentia, Portentia, yeah. Evelyn. This is my aunt. Hi. Ooh. Nice to meet you. Yeah. yeah. She's. It's not nice. It's, 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 it's not personal. Yeah. I mean, you're the one who says that, right? It's not personal. It's just business. Exactly. In a, in, a, in a way, you taught us to destroy you. So, think on this. And that's why, because I appreciate your acumen, your fighting for what you believe in. What if this time we joined up, we partnered to New World? Acquisitions Incorporated and Drawn Enterprises have very little footprint here in the world of Greyhawk. We could start making some deals. We could. We could, but it's also like, especially at the founding, especially yeah. here at the beginning of the process, like, yeah. I don't know if we really want like loser energy yeah. Yeah, to we, get, you know what I mean? And we don't really need, like we don't really need. Exactly. You. As much as you yeah. and us. Loser I'm, energy. Well, I'm, a, I'm worried that it's going to sort of infect because the vibes are. Yeah. It's off. It's off. It's not a brand it's match. Off. It's, it's off. It's off. It's off. And there's some cultural distinctions as well. Yeah. Um, just between our organizations. So. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm afraid we're going to have to pass on this one. Yeah. Huh. Oh, you look hurt. Oh, this is on. See, this is why we usually hire somebody to do this. The. This is a, the this why it should be an email. The Portentia in front of you collapses, oh. and uh, Bobby and Evelyn, you see suddenly the two of them splattered with blood. Oh! oh out of nowhere? Out of nowhere. Blech, blech. Are you okay? Blech. Do you hear it? Blech. 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 What blood is that? Uh, is this like an actual, instead of metaphorical, blood on my hands yeah, type yeah. of thing? Well, no, and it's like they're, but they're connected, mm. right? The two are connected for mm. sure. Ugh. How are you sleeping through this? Tim mm. just like screams in the middle of his sleep and is still sleeping. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna reach over to that that long, like the top of that cloak, and just give it a couple quick tugs. Like, Jim. 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 Make another constitution saving throw. <laughs> well, plus zero, so let's see how this goes. <laughs> now, we decided that the 15 year anniversary symbol is it's the 20. one. Well, you told me last time. God damn it! Here, we can go to the fucking tape. You told me that the AI Here. symbol is the twenty. Yeah. All right. I, Jim, roll the fifteen. And so you wake up. Ugh! And, and I'm, you... I'm covered in blood. It's like, yeah, yeah. Welcome. Thanks. Thanks for coming back. Oh God, it happened again. <laughs> and you have the benefits of a short rest. Oh, I'm so jealous. Oh. Oh, somebody gets a rest. How many spell slots does that give me? <laughs> uh, actually, uh, you can have some back because of your arcane recovery. I have that, yes. So I'm going to recover a slot. You can't stop me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to stop okay. you. I think that if you hit the short rest button, it just, oh, gives, is that you, just like do gives it? you the opportunity. Yeah. yeah. Go right back up to the top. I know exactly where that is. Oh, arcane recovery. Once per day, when you finish a short rest, you can choose Expended spell slots to recover up to Which, a combined level of two, and none of the slots can be six. I don't even have six level or higher slots. My slots are way lower. Yeah. So you already gave yourself a spell, a second level spell back. So we Gucci gang. I can do one more though. I can do up to two. Ooh. More missiles. I'm gonna get another first level spell back too. I'm ready to go. Okay. Go. What was it like? Yeah. Rest. Yeah. I feel refreshed. Sweet I think Bobby's idea is good. We should all lay down. Yeah. I'm like just Sleepy drenched time. in gore. Really, you guys are gonna sleep now? We've got <laughs> shit to do. Everybody's laying yeah. down for nap time. The, the elevator speeds up some more. Oh no. And, Close your eyes. And now there is a flash of purple, deep purple light. So Evelyn, nice. you shut your eyes. Mm -hmm. Minor, I shut it to you. All right. You know what? The purple's probably gonna be good. Oh, you no, shut this. your eyes, you did I it. Shut, I shut my eyes, my eyes are shut. I, I think they just woke me up, so I'm like, what? And then the purple <laughs> light probably like. Yeah. This is on brand. Yeah. No, my, I, I think my eyes are open. Yeah, but I did open. Yeah. All right, everyone, a constitution saving throw again, but the two of you who shut your eyes, you have advantage. Nice. Um, it's a very easy. <laughs> oh. Uh-oh, good thing I have advantage. 
20. <gasps> well, 19 plus 1, 20. So yeah. filthy 20. But yes. 21. Eight. Without it using my advantage. Twins that's again. Really... 18 plus 3, 21. Wow. Yeah. Seven. Eh, yeah, that's lower. I mean, you my advantage? <laughs> three. <laughs> huh? Twins. Sort of. We're in failure. <laughs> yeah. Failure, failure twins. twins. Failure twins. <laughs> All right. The failure twins. <laughs> <laughs> you, you each take five psychic damage. Oh. As this uh, blasts, and then the th- the three of you who succeeded, uh, you each regain seven hit points. Ooh. Are you kidding? What? Oh Eyes God. closed at the move. You woke me up to get screwed. <laughs> <laughs> just like yawning. Is... What's going? Ah! This is just ah, shapes, ah, ah, tentacles. <laughs> And then it suddenly stops. Mm. Oh, thank God. And then a green gas is <gasps> emitted into the room. Here, here. I'm just going to direct you to a wall. Yep, that's a wall. exactly what I'm doing. <laughs> yeah. I have Chippy, my pickaxe, oh, yeah. that does hella damage to walls. I immediately run to a wall and start hacking. All right. Uh, you hit, go ahead and roll damage. And pick a wall. Which wall are you uh, going anyone. for? This. The, the wall. We could just leave. Here? We could go this way. Oh, yeah. <laughs> in this space. Yeah. We're out of here. Go home. Uh, so when I'm hitting walls, it's uh, 2d8 plus uh, 1d6 of fire damage. Three. Mm-hmm. Five. Eight. Mm-hmm. And then... Nine. <laughs> well, and add your proficiency bonus. What's right? Because... Or would it be your strength modifier for pickaxe? Add your strength modifier. Plus five, so 14. All right, because of uh, the adamantium, uh, you do manage to break (laughs) through some of the mortar and some of that green gas begins to vent. Wick out. out, (laughs) Outward. But now I need everyone to make another constitution saving throw. This is the worst throw. elevator. Do we get advantage because the gas is leaving? Yes. Yay. Oh, natural 20. Perfect. Ooh. I definitely need the what advantage. What are we rolling for? <clears throat> constitution so saving. Constitution. And, you, and you have advantage. 21. And 15, eight. Oh, 15 plus three, so 18. 18 that's good. That's an eight with advantage. Uh, four. With advantage? Oh, no. Any, I had 20. 20? Uh, 21. Eight. The drones. <laughs> <laughs> Again. Uh, you are lucky. Uh, with this roll, you each take only one poison damage. Oh, thank God. But we don't like it. I mean, uh, nobody Bob, likes poison. Bobby, do you want to keep? Yes. All right. Please. I'm going to hack away. I'm going to get us out of here. Okay. Seven plus okay. eight is what? 15. 15, 15 plus... Two, 17. 17 plus your? Plus five. five. So it's 20. 22. 22. You shatter a hole in the wall right here, uh, <gasps> big enough that uh, you can go through it. And you see on the other side this vast space uh, with a sort of lower arena area. I don't uh, like that word. Uh-uh. And, <laughs> and as you... Fight. As you uh, blast the wall open, you hear uh, a feminine voice yell out, What What have you done to my house? (laughs) Sorry. Do you see anything? You hear the voice coming from right over here. Oh. So not. Not yeah. within view. I'm gonna. Here. I'm gonna peek in the manner of like a Scooby Doo <laughs> sort of show. I'm just gonna peek from the bottom, and then our heads all come out. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Five heads. Same. You see, hovering over a pile of dwarf skeletons, a behold. <gasps> Good thing oh. you peeked. Hell yeah. Well, we already know how to fight this thing. Didn't we? Sorry, we was, cannot fight that thing. There was poison that gas. That one was cut in half. We didn't want to die. We apologize for hurting your house. I say, I say, just between you, me, and the fence post, that that elevator is not up to code. Oh, it was it poison? It was supposed to be sleep gas, well, so you could rest. Ah, uh, well, listen. Aww. But it was sleep, and then it was dark visions. 
and then yeah. it was poison, and then it was actually like I think more poison. Yeah. So there's you need to get somebody in to look at it. It's a lot of poison. <laughs> <laughs> we <We're> crew. <laughs> we need repairs immediately <laughs> in the holding pen. I am so sorry. The beholder says to you. Uh, you see that the beholder. She's great. You see that the beholder has bows tied around oh, yes. several of her eye stocks. Eye stocks? Oh, we love this. What Never color are the bows? Uh, one is pink, one is purple, oh, and. Yeah. Of the rays, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, green. Yes, yeah. Yeah. we love Black, a color probably for the queen. Death. Yeah. Oh. We apologize for putting a hole in the wall, but we have to say that your bows look fantastic. <gasps> you are far too kind. Now, quickly, quickly, come, come out! I cannot have, have you perishing in what was supposed to be the room of your rest. Oh. I come scurrying out like yeah. I like her. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey. Just hey, you know. You can distance though. Yeah, yeah, over here is fine. Yeah. You're coming out too. I'll you? come out. I'll o sure. Over I'll here stretch. on this side is fine. Yeah. But see, we now, ma'am, we are not entirely certain of how we came to end up in your holding pen. Uh, we did we materialized in there. I don't know if that's some unique property of your uh, of your your holding pen. It just it handles the whole process end yes. to end. Yes. It seeks out. Prisoners and but the rea them? the reality is you're very lucky that we've ended up here. We are space cops tasked with <laughs> I look over, I look over. <laughs> with <laughs> the safe disposal of impossibilities. And if we're here, there are, there's something that could damage your wonderful abode. I'm looking all this. This is very beautiful. And there could be something that makes. That, that ruins all this. And I just like take out like a tablet and I cast uh, distort value on it to make it look, and with my mouth I go boop, 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 Oh yeah, I, I, and I back the whole thing, I'm like, whoa, mm -hmm. whoa, yep, whoa. Yep, yep, see that's your problem right whoa. there. Whoa. Yep. Do you have any obsidian shards in here? Well, it's quite possible. <gasps> we, we have many who come through by, rest chambers, they invite travelers in, provide rest when they're not malfunctioning, mm -hmm. and then we have some recreation, and some, some tales are, are told, and depending upon how, how the fun and the play goes, then you might go in one of the other rooms of Rest or a, the room of farewell, uh, uh, oh. or the room of bye bye forever, oh. uh, or the room of yum yum time. Oh, wow. These are a lot of rooms. Can wow. I go to the yum yum time? No. I don't, I don't think we should go to that room. No, so, that room. No. No. Only, only after recreation can you go to bye bye forever, yum yum times, or. <laughs> Or farewell. This is oh, legitimately fuck. great. Now, uh, yes, they didn't Evelyn. mention she, you didn't mention the restroom. Could we go to the rest Ooh, room, room first before recreation? Because we could use some rest. Uh, well, there, right. there the was the rest, <laughs> the <laughs> rest room, unfortunately, was malfunctioning. Oh, the one we just came out of. <sighs> yes. Could we just rest in that room for a minute? Mm. Uh, no, the poison <laughs> gas. <laughs> and, I love her. And. Yes. And at this, this door opens up, and emerging from it yes. is a tentacled oh, no. creature. Oh, wow. It's uh, fine if it knocks the doors yeah, off. I, I think that's actually really In funny. In fact, it does knock the doors off because yeah. it is so big. <laughs> uh, and <laughs> This is a cartoon. And <laughs> this... This oh, Otiug comes out. I was like, dude, this is like, a, this is like, this adventure has got the shambling mounds. It's got the Otiugs. Mm -hmm. Like, it is mm -hmm. popping. Mm -hmm. What's this thing called? <laughs> An Otiug. 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 Oh my god, it's, it's one of the cute. most classic. Yeah. One of the most mm -hmm. awesome, old school, like original monster manual. He looks great. Oh, he looks way yucky. The, the old ones are very silly. I'll show you a picture. Um, 
And I say, well, you know, obviously, I mean, we're very concerned. I'm going I'm to raise my voice above the howling and shrieks of the Atyug. I'm going to say, well, I mean, I'm very concerned uh, that that some of the impossibility that my associate mentioned before may be affecting the functioning of of the rooms it's themselves. Probably why you got a poison gas leak, and the entire time going boop 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 boop. I, I think I think before anything <sighs> happens, before anything starts, we should make sure that that you're delivering a great experience. You're delivering the experience that you want to here in your home. Well, first, I my work crew, and she she nods toward the Atiyag. He's the work crew? This and, is the guy? And you notice that in one of its tentacles, it has what looks like a toolbox. Oh, it, it's oh, calling it around? Right. And it it comes. Oh, uh, my lord. And as it comes over, uh, you hear in your minds, I beg your pardon, so sorry it wasn't Excuse working properly. <laughs> Oh, okay. Thank you so much. Yeah, yeah. okay. Thanks, thanks, buddy. I beg your pardon. Uh, I look down at Chippy. I say, hey, have you seen something like this before? Oh, here we go. <laughs> and Chippy is silent. Ah! Ah! Gotcha! Ah! Chippy's no. dead. Chippy. What do you think about that? Chippy, no! Chippy. A family <laughs> crisis. <laughs> right, here. Chippy. Is, is there, there someone, someone else, else here you're, you're talking, talking to? to? The beholder says. I'm just very attached to my pickaxe. I, I just want, want to make sure that I have a proper accounting of the contestants for our recreation. Contestants. Oh, contestants. We are we've got a union job to do. Simple blue collar folk. Yeah. yeah. We, we wanna, wanna just, we wanna get this obsidian shard packed up for you so that your next contestant, imagine if they died to that poison gas like we almost did. Absolutely. That's no fun for you. That's no fun for you to watch. I, I didn't catch your name, by the way. I'm, I'm certainty drawn and, oh well. She, I curtsy. She sort of bobs in the air <laughs> uh, with, with her eye stalks sort of going forward and she says, A pleasure to meet you. I am Miss Alba T. Ross. <laughs> cool, cool, cool. Really? All right. Well. <laughs> Everybody else is like, yeah, jump in. You may call me Miss Ross. Okay. If you're nasty. Ross. Yeah, yeah. Are you, are you taken, Miss Ross? Yeah. <laughs> taken? Is there a Mr. Ross? <laughs> a Bob? I am far Bob. too busy running <laughs> Miss Ross's <laughs> arena of terror <laughs> to have a significant <laughs> other. Well, absolutely. You're married to the game. That's what I'm hearing. Right? No, and listen, but I mean but again, our our concern is, you know, obviously any small business. It's, it really has to do with repeat customers, yeah. and so our concern is that if things are not moving, things are not moving correctly. Th this impossibility shard we described before. If we're not able to manage this, our concern obviously is that you know in the future, as you're cycling through contestants, mm -hmm. they're not going to be having the experience that you intended. I mean, and first the room of rest malfunctions, then your num num room malfunctions. Then what are we going to do? And the forever goodbye. What if that starts well? Do you want them now telling their friends chaos. about a yuck yuck room that yeah. they experienced yeah. at your carnival of terror? Oh, no. yeah. that, that would be. Mm, this is not all we're, good. This not is good. all we're saying. But however, some of the help would not prefer a yuck yuck room. In fact, there has been a petition. <laughs> oh, Fridays, we're turning it into a yuck yuck, <laughs> yuck, yuck room. Everybody, all right, get together. Yuck yuck Fridays. Yuck, yuck, yuck Fridays. Yeah. 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 Well, I'm, you know, she if, is if, we, resolute. Yeah. if we need to participate, you know, I would love to see the contract she has drawn up for us as performers. And, you know, as long as the terms are fair. First, you keep mentioning, and here she looks at you, certainty, impossibility. What do you mean by that? I'm talking... Far, Where do you want to start? Far realm. Far realm. Crashing into this realm, ripping... Tell her about the last Cats place we were at, Dad. Cats and Where dogs. the floor together. ripped apart. Tell her about that beautiful room no, no, no. created by no. a sealed Dracana. Well, imagine a situation. Destroyed. Imagine That's a situation. One of our happy clients, by the way, you can call her up. Absolutely. The Dracana is very happy with our work. No, and, we, and obviously we can offer a full client list um, at any time. But let's get into it. I mean, imagine a situation where, just as an example, and I, I, I step down 
into the what? No arena. Oh, okay. And I say, and I say, <laughs> as you do so, oh, oh boy. this oh! center diamond <laughs> suddenly illuminates and red light shoots up from the floor to the ceiling, <laughs> and there and there is sudden dramatic music that goes. Bum, <laughs> From American Gladiators. Yeah, exactly. This is gonna be a little fun. Start cheering. I say, I say, I'll continue. <laughs> and as as that dramatic music starts to swell, the pile of dwarf bones no. underneath her, all of the skeletons animate, and about twenty five dwarf skeletons clamber up onto these bleachers what? over here. They're the- and, the audience? and they start cheering uh, as you near the center as of the arena. As soon as Jim hears the crowd cheering, he steps down into the arena. <laughs> and now as another contestant enters the arena, now a green shaft of light shoots up and then there's another bum bum. And the skeletons all cheer and you will say, Jim anyway. releases dubs. Anyway, <laughs> are they crystal? Ooh. They are. Oh, this is crystal so much dubs! Oh. Is the light still shining? That's pretty cool. Yes. Oh. And they, when they go oh. green through the crystal, do they, does yes. it prism all around the room? So oh. it prisms yeah, all over the room. Uh, and so I need somebody to, uh, here, someone go ahead and you roll. You just thought you were doing something cool. <laughs> and now you're gonna kill us all. He's gonna fuck us with our own Well, you dick. walk downstairs. <laughs> I heard the applause. <laughs> All right. He was naturally drawn to it. So, as as your cr- crystal doves cause this light to bounce <laughs> all over, um, Miss Ross suddenly is startled. Someone roll a d10 for me. Absolutely. Aww. I got you. No problem. Watch this. Five. Five. We never right. saw that one. Solid. Oh, uh, does one of her rays go off? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Uh, so, uh, one of her her rays, this is a purple ray, fires at the dove, uh, but misses and hits the wall over there. Yeah. And there is sort of a purplish glimmer on it, and then it goes away. You're not sure what that ray No, did. well, I'm, I'm glad. Um, I'm glad. Well, anyway, as I was saying, what was that? <laughs> this is just, Obviously, you know, spectacle. Yeah, 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 exactly. I'm gonna, I'm gonna fly over to sit with the audience. And when she asked what was that, I'm like, oh, he's so good, you should watch it. <laughs> really amazing. I, I, I believe if, if, if your, your companions, companions are starting the first round, round you better get, get down, down there with them. them. Oh, but uh, can't I just watch with you? I think she gets mean fast. <laughs> uh, anyone, anyone who does not have a ticket is Escorted to the Bye Bye Forever room. Oh, okay. <laughs> Evelyn hops down. So how do we, since since we woke up without coming here of our own volition, is how do we find a ticket? Is there a box office somewhere? Mm-hmm. I want to buy a ticket. <laughs> the, the box office is through those large doors that are now lying on the floor. That also will have to now be fixed. She yells. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. And he's over there. He's got his hammers and every one of these weird tendrils. I, I would like to go in the box office and buy a ticket. Uh, in, so Bobby, inside, uh, you can see immediately where the box office is. Uh, it is this fireplace and it's, there are words that say box office, and inside the fireplace sitting is an azer, a dwarf made oh. entirely out of fire. Mm-hmm. Ah. Uh, I'd like to approach him and say, uh, hello, uh, good sir, I see you're made of fire. My pickaxe <laughs> is also covered in flames. We share this. That doesn't anything for you. Infatuation for heat. Sweet, uh, sweet. <laughs> yeah, I was wondering, can I get a ticket so I can watch this first round before it kicks off? I want to get out there fast. 200 gold. You've never seen a show like it. It's well, it. so so question, so three of my friends are actually in the show. <laughs> so they told me they'd hook me up with the discount or even oh, like, like no, free but, tickets. No, you're looking for Will Call. Yeah, they're yeah. looking for Will Call. Will Call, maybe. Hold, please. Mm. He goes through <laughs> a little file. 
Your name again? Uh, uh, <laughs> um, Bob Ross. I'm related to uh, Miss Miss Ross. Distant cousin, so she doesn't even know. I'm here in surprise, actually. That, that seems almost like an impossibility. Yeah, you got some uh, shards around here. Uh, and he, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, Mr. Ross. I have, I have no record that there was a ticket waiting for you. This is, I. This is one of the. This is one of the dumbest things. I know. <laughs> At this point, Jim is asking if uh, they want to they pick a card. He's like, he's just put on a show. Oh, Bob oh yeah, he's there. just he's doing magic, yeah, right? He's got I'm, the drums out. And, oh, and when even when this, you when go is down, there left. is a golden shaft of light that shoots up and another swell of dramatic music. <gasps> oh! And, and the crowd of skeletons, they cheer. <gasps> Right, we so are getting very close, close everyone, everyone, to starting the show. All right, uh, I'll trade you a water skin. That it's won't thirsty. do. Either you have a ticket, or you go into the arena, or you go to the Bye Bye Forever Road. I'll go to the arena. <laughs> <laughs> you, 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 you come stopping up, but you have to like lower your head yeah. to get through <laughs> the arch. Yeah. 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 A pink shaft of light shoots down when you enter a bobby, and there is another cheer from the crowd. I'm also angrily dragging my feet the way yeah. only a teenager does. Yeah, you know, exactly. just don't lift them at all. <laughs> I take the long way around. Yeah, yeah, oh, you go all the way around. I like around, say, as I'm walking past Miss mm -hmm. Ross, beep, 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 this will reflect in your better Dungeon <laughs> Bureau rating. Yeah. I, I will BDB. take yeah. part of this, but the DDB. I only have, I can only do so much. Yeah. Right? I just have like, the one this form is, to fill This out. is just, like you got doors hanging off the hinges. Yeah. You got poison gas. You're not yeah. respecting yeah. Well, while she's the badge on office. this, I am definitely casting a healing spell on myself. Mm -hmm. So that I'm not murdered the very first thing that happens here. <laughs> yeah, very just, uh, you know, just letting you know. Let, Let round one begin. begin. And when she says this, uh, three different rays shoot off from her eye stalks. One hits a spot of the ceiling and disintegrates it. Oh. Uh, another one hits one of the skeletons and instantly turns it to stone. Oh. Uh, and then the other one just sort of <gasps> hits this wall and just flower petals burst out. Oh, I like that one. But that as, right? as soon as she says this, fire erupts oh, no. uh, to block mm. Mm. the oh, no. stairs up. And then you can see also a faint force field appears all around <sighs> the upper mm. edge. Everyone the plan. And mm -hmm. you look up toward the ceiling where those those shafts of light were going, and the ceiling opens up, and hurtling down toward you looks like a giant thing of jello. Oh. And. Before it hits, can I stick my javelin there? And so, oh, just landing uh, on me. Jim and Bobby, I need both of you to make oh. dexterity saving throws as the dexterity. gelatinous cube comes falling Dex. down from the ceiling. Bad. I got a plus two. No, that's good. 11. 20, natural 20. Whoa. Nice. You weren't even standing so there. No, 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 no gelatinous cubes. Not on me. No. 11. <gasps> Bobby, <laughs> you. <laughs> Bobby. <laughs> you, Bobby, are now <laughs> inside the gelatinous cube. Always inside something. And <laughs> next, on the other Gold. side of the <laughs> shaft of light, no. up above, no. a. a it opens up and you hear a and this undead ogre just falls just, oh God, from the, the ceiling and just slams onto the <laughs> ground with a kind of pulpy sound as it hits. Oh. But it's just a sack. But it seems more or less okay. And then from the whole arena all around you, uh, you hear a voice that says, Round one, fight! fight. <laughs> and I need you all to roll initiative. I can do that. I love it. Good number? Four plus one is five. Well, well here, five minus one is four. Aw, <laughs> cute. All right, so Omen, you're at four. Evelyn, you're at five. 
Yep. You got some good here, kid? 15 plus 2, so that's 17. Mm. Nice. 11 plus 1 is 12. All right, so certainty you were at 17. Mm -hmm. What do you got, Mork? And 12 for Bobby. Mm -hmm. I, I rolled a 8 plus 2 is 10 for Jim. I don't have anything cool left to do. All my slots are expended. All my channels oh, are what done. Was Jim's? Ten. Just go in Ten. the corner and sleep, and we'll fight. Okay. <laughs> we'll take Good turns. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> go sleep in one of those big fires. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I am. I am Crystal. Probably Actually, fine. Actually, honestly, it's legit. Yeah. If this square is keeping me safe, can I sleep in this Jello? It is eating you alive. You yeah. Yeah. Oh. There's no air in there. there... Yeah, you'll suffocate uh, in the acid. Is Jordan Sparks? No air. No air. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly right. <laughs> Jelly cube, not great. Mm. But Thankfully, possibly edible. Your pick, I don't think, can be eaten by acid because it's adamantium, right? That's. The, you think so? You uh, think so? But, Bobby, so now that you realize that you are completely engulfed yes. by this gelatinous substance, yes. you take 10 acid damage ah. from it as it oh. begins digesting you. Yeah, yeah. And you are, uh, you also find you can't breathe and you are restrained. Mm. Question, you, since my, sorry. No, you go. I since my pickaxe is on fire, is this thing taking damage immediately from being on fire from the inside? Magical fire. Magic. Magical fire. Not that you can see the Morden yet. Mm. thing. Okay. It's going to start to bubble and, and flap. Yeah. Right? It's going to get warm in there. So first up is this undead ogre who shambles up onto its feet and tries to clobber you, Evelyn. Hello, nice to meet you. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> and, but it's coming down? <laughs> it got only a 13 to hit. Uh, my armor class is 13. <gasps> so it hit you. Yeah. You take 13 bludgeoning oh, damage. Ow! Not nice! And it hurls you backward into the, into the cube. <laughs> no! I need you to make a dexterity saving throw to see if you can avoid going into the cube. I can fly. Do I get advantage? Because if I'm airborne, I can like steer. I'm used no, to that. I love what you're, I'm hearing. You're thrown that off makes enough sense, in right? this case. Yeah. You can fly out. This J Cross, is, no fun. Yeah. <laughs> this is like the duo in every video game that where you get two classes that synergize perfectly together. Mm -hmm. This is these two dudes, this undead man and this just lot and yeah. this cube. They yeah, have this it dialed de in. De deck built. Yeah. Uh, right? They net decked. They know it. It was two tens. So it didn't matter that I rolled advantage, even though you said I couldn't have it. Uh, and my deck save is plus one, so 11. You also now go into the cube, and you take 10 acid hey, damage. Hey, listen, luckily there's not a whole lot more if room inside thing, the cube. I was going to say, if that thing gets full mechanically, does yeah. that mean we stop fitting? <laughs> we'll like, see. if you can't we'll fit see any more minis there. in there? Yeah, because <laughs> this, this cube has to be pretty big, right? Yeah. It's spacious. Because I'm... I'm, I mean, look, I'm you huge. both are in there. Yeah, yeah. spacious. Like, I don't think fit. I could fit another one. We'll see. Castle Hotel. Hi, <laughs> friend. Hey. Well, once one of you is digested completely, oh, then there's, 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 there's more space. Yeah. Yeah. Just get those bones, push them to the side yeah. of the cube. Yeah. I mean, as soon as some of our limbs start getting digested, even. Oh, then, it's yeah. going to be a room in there. Yeah. Savings. Uh, certainty, what do mm -hmm. you do? First, using my bonus action, I'm going to cast Healing Word on myself, which is just fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's not bad. So I heal for six, which is good because I only had three hit points left. It's, it's getting bad. Yeah. That's what I'm hearing. It's it's bad over here. Oh, heal for 60? No, six. I wish. Ah, keep it. Okay, and then for my action, um, uh, I can only do a cantrip because that was a spell, so I'm going to... Eat a Lunchable. Move... <laughs> behind my dad. <laughs> uh, and um, shoot a ray of frost at the gelatinous cube. Nice. I don't want to like hit it with something that might potentially hurt my friends. Yeah, I was going to say, do we have to worry about hitting the people inside the cube? Oh, we're yeah. friends? Yeah. Uh, not, sure. not sure. Who knows? <laughs> um, that's a 15. You hit. Okay. So I do five frost damage to it. Uh, the outer surface of of, uh. of the gelatinous uh, cube, it freezes over and sort of sort of almost looks like a, a jello with like icy frosting on top. Dope. 
So on a hit, its speed is reduced by 10 feet until the start of my next turn. So this gives the rest of us a chance to get a little Slow bit away from cubes. it. Slow cubes. <laughs> That's my turn. All right. And that did not hurt either of you who are inside. Perfect. Good to know. We love that. We love that. Now, I mean, where do we go next? Bobby, what do you do? Now, uh, you can try to wiggle out. Mm-hmm. And to, if you want to do that, that will take your action to do it, and it's a strength check. Oh, that's, well, that's great. That's, that's great for me. So okay. So I mean, I know I never play Barb, so I don't really know what's going on with it, right? Um, so you can flip out and rage. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then does that is that what gives you the extra action? Like no. So he's multi-classed. <laughs> yes. So he's getting it from fighter. Yeah. Oh, uh, but I already... Yeah, 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 because I'm, I'm just trying to figure out, is there a way for him to get out and also get a whack in But I think thing? if he rages, mm -hmm. he does get advantage on some strength checks. Strength checks oh, well, there you go. Yeah. It would be there. Yeah, I get advantage I feel like on strength it's a, checks. I feel like if you're going to freak out, this is a good time. So we're going to go ahead and rage. <coughs> oh. Rage! Rage! <laughs> okay. Let's that slip was, out. That was the last rage. Come on. Oh. Advantage. Advantage. I know. I'm just gonna. Yeah. I'm taking a second to. Yeah, yeah fair. To center yourself. Mm -hmm. Lathander. Oh my gosh. Four plus three is seven. You do not manage to wiggle oh. out. Man, I really thought it was gonna work. Yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, so mechanically, seven, you had it set up. You know what I mean? It looked right. Mm. Jim, what do you do? You can see Bobby struggling. He almost looks like uh, someone swimming, but like yeah. floundering. Uh, and you, it both he, he and Evelyn look like they're having trouble breathing inside. I was gonna go for the ogre, but it's scary. Do I think, I'm gonna ask you a question, Jeremy. All right. <laughs> Do I believe on looking at them, that there is approximately a foot or so of material between them and escape? Like, how deep are they into this thing? They're not actually that deep. I'd say each of them is only like half a foot away. Oh, really? Meaning, like, even someone could probably try reaching in and pulling them out. Well, I'm not doing that. <laughs> that sounds <laughs> crazy. crazy. <laughs> I will, however, what I would like to attempt to do is use prestidigitation, which allows me to flavor one cubic foot of material. And I would like to flavor it like cheese. Oh, oh. let's go. Right in front of Bobby. But nice. if you eat gelatinous. I don't know. Uh, okay. But it tastes like cheese. Great. We'll find out. <laughs> Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> we'll find out. And then we'll go to the yum, yum room. <laughs> so, yum, 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 yum. Oh, you're forever. in there. This you're, is the yum, yum room. So you get, you get inspiration for oh. doing that. Uh, and here, I will give you, as so you have a reminder of it, I'll give you one of these fancy dice. Ooh. So just spend okay. that die when you want to use your inspiration, and you'll have advantage on a roll. Eat, Bobby! And, Eat! And, and, and Bobby, you can... Uh, the flavor, because again, you're all so it's sassy. all around you, some of it gets in your mouth, and you can also uh, smell it. It's a, it's a tang, a what, sharp cheddar. What kind of cheese? I'm trying to think what Bobby likes. I don't know. I'm going to go with the most? a nice, maybe like a cheddar. Yeah, mm. sharp. Sharp cheddar. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Aged. Perfect. <laughs> the jaw starts moving a little bit more. <laughs> <laughs> and I start to eat. <laughs> <laughs> Biting my way. With uh, are, 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 are Evelyn and I close enough? Like when she got knocked in, are we touching? Uh, you are not touching, but you're, you're not but, far. But you're within like an inch of each other. Can can we move our limbs close enough to each other? We're like we could grab hands. Mm, we're yeah. together. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. I think so too. So we've got we're locked by the by the forearm. Mm -hmm. the, right. Warrior the grip. Warrior grip. Exactly. Mm -hmm. And I'm eating and trying to eat <laughs> my way out of this. <laughs> Probably <laughs> not. Good. You know what? I'm not. I'm not swallowing it because I know it tastes like it. <laughs> I'm chewing to make it much no, more. But it's hard. Though. But it's hard, right? Yeah, You're yeah, like, yeah. I can't swallow it. Yeah. It's like a, it's a, it's, a, it's a slime tasting. Yeah. <sighs> yes. Slime. Gotta spit. So slime. always ah, just enough to move around in it enough, and then then I then I get out. Do you get inspired? We both get out. 
That's yep. what I'm doing. Well, that's, <laughs> that, that's definitely the intention. <laughs> <laughs> and then I get out and I win D&D. I'm level 10. Ta-da. And then I win. So uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. <laughs> So you begin your t- your tasting, uh, and we'll see where your, that goes. Your tasting menu. Uh, <laughs> I didn't have much else, man. I'm hey, sorry. No, it's, it's better than what I can. I've definitely Here. never seen anyone try to eat a gelatinous cube. I'm really curious. You've it inspired. You've yeah. inspired him. Now, do you want to get the f away from this cube? Yeah, because your movement's still real. Certainty. <laughs> <laughs> We're just all standing all behind you. Up. Really? <laughs> it's just like hand to hand. Yeah, yeah. We're all behind you. We're conga line. <laughs> all right. Now. Evelyn Marthing. Mm-hmm. It's my turn. It's you. It is. And after Evelyn is Omen. So um, you can attack inside these things, right? I mean, I remember back in the day, you yeah, used to you're be res- able to... You're, re- you're restrained, but you, that just means you attack with disadvantage. Uh, or, Evelyn, you could try to make a strength check to get yourself out. I'm very low on hit points. I don't want to stay in here. I know what happens. No, no, get him out. Uh, and there is some momentum here. And because of the destabilization of the cheese tasting going on, <laughs> that's right. It's uh, up market. You have you have advantage if you make the strength check. Uh, that sounds great. Yeah, Can yeah. I pull him out with me if I get? Oh out? yeah, or at he's least, like fr- he is he is the source of the I'd destabilization. Like hold- his hand so he could maybe get a little advantage you next can, time. You could definitely give him a leg up. Okay. Or or more appropriately a leg out. All right. Ooh. Rolled a sixteen. Like or a seven. So checks, sixteen. Right? Yep. Strength save or check. Check. Well, it's plus four. Yeah, it's Ooh. fucked. Yeah, it's a dirty twenty. A dirty twenty. Sweet. So, uh, the two of you working as a team, You're Evelyn, born again. you, you, come out. There is a sort of slurping noise as she emerges from oh. the jello. Yeah. Uh, and. Uh, Can I get out of there? Go, yeah, I want out of there real bad. Go ahead and place yourself uh, next to the cube on any side of it of your choice, uh, and you manage you don't you don't manage to get uh, Bobby all the way out, but you get yeah, tilt Bobby. You get you get Bobby part of the way out. Okay. Base, so I can breathe. Yeah, I pull his. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> That would make sense because you were eating the way. Mm-hmm. So I'm gonna I'm gonna pull your face. Just... Evelyn, anything else? That was my action. That was your action. Let's ask me a way for us to use this hot fire. I have mm-hmm. obviously your weapons are still killing it, right? Dylan, yeah. But there Dylan. has to be a way to use these fire curtains. Yeah. On these creatures, right? Maybe. Yeah, I don't have anything else I can use. All my. Do you have control flames? Control flames? I don't have it prepared. Sometimes I have control flames. Uh, right now I don't have control uh, flames. That's all I can do. All right, Omen. Yes. Okay, Your help. turn. Um, so now it's, it's, this, it's this arena conga line situation behind me. This is a toughie, and I would love to solicit advice from my allies on this. This slime thing can... It can devour an unlimited number, basically. It's just going to keep on moving around and shoving people into it. And if they're stuck in there, they're going to take 10 points of acid damage, like, all the time. That's yeah. bad, yeah. They're bo- but but this is definitely an ogre. The ogre hasn't it's gone gonna, yet, has he? It's going to throw you in the goop. Oh, yeah, he did go. In yeah, the goop. I mean, this is, that's his whole job. So you, you basically, you're going to end up inside this goop. But what if you threw him in the goo? Mm-hmm. Or into the fire. The goo, mm-hmm. the goo yeah. or the guy yeah. in the I mean, fire. I think for me, I think the, the right call for me is actually to get around behind this so that I'm not available for him to pick up people and throw them in. Oh. Oh. Huh. And, oh, that's, that's interesting. That's a, that's <laughs> yeah. a choice, considering you're the yeah. meteor. And, that, and then I'm you're going the to... Meteor of the, you're going to leave the wizards in the front and line. And then I'm okay. going to beat mm-hmm. the slime. With my maul, mm-hmm. and since it's not <laughs> sharp, it's just, probably better than it could be. I'm staring at you like, no, Nancy. <laughs> <laughs> so me and Jim are hiding behind nothing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, I'm hiding behind you. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jim's yeah. fine. Yeah. Um. So, but this this is what I'm gonna do. So, weapon, a flame, uh, from the uh the, the sacred flame we were able to derive in the last adventure. So, uh, I'm definitely going to try to whack this very large cube. Uh, with that, and then I'm going to use my uh, my station as a war priest 
they get one additional one additional physical attack. So let's try to do this the only way we know how. You know what I mean? Get crazy. Do it. Do it. Destroy it. Uh, how do we feel about a 13, a 9? That plus, is. Yeah, see, because he, he beat. Um, all right, here. So we're going to roll our damage. And then how much is the additional flame damage? Is it just a d6? It's a d6. d6. I never had a chance to use it last time. Mm-hmm. So so it's, we're talking about 3d6 plus 2. I mean, we don't hate that. 6. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay, mm-hmm. okay. Mm-hmm. Mm, okay. 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 So thirteen. Yeah. Plus two. Fifteen points. We say so. Fifteen points of damage. We love how it feels. Is it set on fire? Uh, it does not catch on fire, but it does, like, quiver, separate, uh, from the pain of yeah. not only not only the weapon hitting, but the fire. Yeah, and chewing from the inside, and also the chewing from <laughs> and the, the and being gnawed from within. <laughs> now, that's its own fault. So, uh, I am going to uh, roll that second attack. Um, here we go. That is an eighteen on the dice plus the four for a twenty-two. Um, we will now roll three d six. So four plus six is ten. Plus three is thirteen. Plus two is another fifteen. Probably just spit me out at this point. Yeah, it's like, oh, it's not worth it. <laughs> uh, it it again shakes in pain, uh, but it is still alive. I mean, such as life is. Yeah, for for, for, for such for, a creature, for sure. a cube. Uh, <clears throat> and now it goes, Bobby. Yeah. You can feel the sizzling on you now. Normally, at this point. You would take twenty-one acid damage. Twenty-one, but because Evelyn pulled you part of the way out, you take only ten acid damage. I, I, I feel like this at this point, as a reaction, I'm going <laughs> to use Stone's Endurance, reduce damage dealt to you by one d12 plus two. Oh, jeez. Yeah, no more of this, that. please. No. D12. You never get to roll a fucking D12. It's so Five fun. Five plus two. That's seven. So. You take three. Three points. Three. You take three damage. Yeah, I'm way better. I'm strong, dude. Yeah. Setting yeah. boundaries. <laughs> and you, <We> love <laughs> it. as you call on uh, your ancestral connection to stone giants, uh, there is actually a rumble in the masonry all mm. around you. This is, yeah. uh, and and some of the light. In the arena, flicker uh, when that happens. Just tap into this. This is cool as shit. And I'm raged, so it's probably like really bright. Oh, I guarantee cool. that's part of it. No question. Oh, that's one thing. So when you were in the ball, you couldn't hear it. But one of the first where you could, you could see it, but you obviously you weren't physically here. Mm-hmm. One of the first creatures we met in this in the uh, series was a stone giant. A stone giant. Oh. So I think that. Yeah. That mm-hmm. heritage might be mm-hmm. that Otosh. yeah, yeah Otosh Katan. I, think I don't know that, if you know each other. Yeah, Probably. Just, yeah. 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 Well, yeah. Actually, right. that's yeah. that's weird to ask. Um, <laughs> but but what I would say is that there's probably is that a distant relation. Any 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 time you're getting that type of response, uh, what's it called a pop? Yeah. <laughs> any any time you're getting that type of pop, like from the literal environment, we have to try to ring this up for all it's worth. Yeah. What other stone stuff do we got? Yeah, I got a bunch of rock shit. Yeah. Let's get crazy. Yeah. Uh, you also, as as that ancestral power protects you and everything shakes, you have this strange, it's like this ping goes out from you and you can feel the stone around you almost as if it were a body. And oh, you can feel you can feel that there is something sick in the stone. Uh, and it and it is over in Corruption. in this culvert. Ooh, yep. <laughs> Listen, we have access to it. That's not outside the arena. Would you say that Jim and I are currently made of stone? <gasps> crystal. Is crystal, is not, crystal stone? not a stone? So I guess so. Okay, just so you're I mean, tapped into. Yeah, I mean, yeah. it seems like that would be important to know. Yeah. It still damaged me the the cube though, right? 
Oh, absolutely. Oh. <laughs> Just check. Yeah, it's a special <laughs> asset, right? All right. So I guess that you also would know something about Jim and I, like our location yeah. or something, I would assume. Mm. You know about their dreams. I sense the both of you are in round one of this room. <laughs> <laughs> I'm wondering how many rounds there are. I would like to ask yeah. the lady. <laughs> yeah, that would be, this would be a great time to ask. Excuse me, ma'am. <laughs> ma'am, uh, Beholder? This is uh, Beholder? And it moves five feet. The two of you, if you want, can take opportunity attacks. You yes, I do. Gonna, yeah, take that's, Absolutely what we're going to do. Get him. Six plus six, 12. I, don't know, I mean, it might yeah. be okay. Yeah, nice. I mean, yeah. Also, it's, if it moved it's away. AC is trash. Yeah. If, if, if it moved away and I was holding on to Bobby, did it pull away from Bobby? Is Bobby born? Like, can I strength okay. check? So now, now even oh. more of Bobby is exposed. But so now Bobby is, you're sort of like holding on to Bobby. And Bobby, you're feet are still <laughs> stuck inside oh, wow. the gelatinous cube. My, okay. I do five plus four, nine damage. All right, now I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try to do something very similar. Um, I'm looking for the big roll. That is a 13 plus four for 17. Three D six plus two damage. Experience it. Two plus four, six. Plus six Ooh. is 12, Ooh. 14 Ooh. points of damage. damage. Nice, impressive. But every, so every time this maul hits it, it just like and flows through the entire. And the fire, uh, it catches for a split second okay, on the to... surface. Uh, and the, ex the outside of the cube is beginning to scorch. Oh. I forgot that I do an extra D6 fire damage. Yeah, so do absolutely you. you do. Five more. Ooh. It is still alive, but also its its form is starting to degrade. Oh, uh, so it's less of a less of a cube. It, it is is less of a cube, and it's turning into more of a lump, a mm -hmm. mound, oh. a gelatinous, a gelatinous lump. lump. Mm -hmm. A gelatinous lump. That was my nickname in high school. <laughs> uh, yeah. And so then, uh, uh oh. Biggie goes this, yeah. and Biggie Smalls. steps over here. <laughs> he doesn't have to do that. And one. Certainty okay. tries to hurl you into the gelatinous cube. Oh. But that might actually do enough damage to it to kill it. So. Yeah. Ooh, it got a 20. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Hey, bud. A, a nat 20? It got a nat 20. Oh, okay. And so. Uh, the fire's gonna be good against the undead. That, that's true. All right, because of the crit, that's Great. thirteen bludgeoning damage. Yeah, oh, I'm crap. I'm out. And yeah. uh, you are hurled toward the cube. And since you're you are knocked out, that means you're gonna automatically we fail. fail a death save. <gasps> no, you'll fail the uh, dexterity saving throw. So oh. so oh, you no. had a chance of not going in, but nope, okay. now you are also inside the cube. Okay, the okay, lump. okay. Yeah. The lump. lump. Is all of her inside of the lump since there's not a lot of space left since it's dying? It, it, all of her is in there. And rather than and taking some. more Obviously. damage mm -hmm. when you go in, you just fail a death save. That's what I was saying. Oh, yeah. Does that? Yeah. That's why I said I fail a death yeah. save, yeah. right? Yeah. So, yeah. so we got to kill this thing fast. Yeah. Get her out, and then we got to go look at this hole. Mm -hmm. See what's got, going on in there. I got a little plan. Uh, and you, you were asking Miss Ross a question. <laughs> yes, uh, I heard round one when this started. I'm just <laughs> no, curious. In the show version of this, this is so funny because she just got flung in. Yeah. We're hitting them. You're like, Miss. I'm sorry, is this, uh, how many rounds are we looking at here, just total? As many rounds as you survive. Oh. Well, when do we okay. get to go to the rooms? If you survive round one, you'll go to the yum yum room. <gasps> okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Is that to get like ready for round two. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, I can't wait. Nope, no, one, one's good for me. Um, all right. Who's up? Yeah. All right, the... The ogre zombie uh, just sort of looks around, strangely confused. You're not mm -hmm. sure why. Certainty, your turn. So, death saving throw. That's a six. Oof. So, certainty already has two failures. This is yes. not good. I'm on my last one. Bobby. I it's a big day for Bobby. 
boots in. Yes. Yeah. When she got flung in, uh huh. Can she see me? Yes. And well, no. She's like she unconscious. Can. She's out. unconscious. Oh, yeah. She's unconscious. Yeah. But you can see her in there. Am I so out. as a barbarian? Mm-hmm. Am I strong enough? To since only my feet are in there, am I strong enough to wiggle my foot to hook around a body part of hers? And as I try to pull myself out, pull her with me. Yes. Yeah, so take your uh, feet to her, like with your yeah. 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 with your position. I was going to give you advantage on the roll to get yourself That's out. Great. I should have that. Yes. Uh, but <laughs> what I will let you do I is I deserve uh, it. Just do this as a. Regular roll without advantage, and if you succeed, you bring certainty with you. This is it now, but but you're still raged, right? So you always have raged. advantage. So you always have. See, that's Whoa. his secret. That's my secret, right? But you don't have it now. Oh. You have disadvantage. Uh, that's canceling it uh, out because yeah, you're, yeah, you're trying to get someone yes. else. Yeah, yeah. Okay. But listen, but it is so fly, like this is the best. <laughs> if this happens, it's like uh. legendary status. I think it's permanent. Mm-hmm. Like, this is really cool. Okay, okay. Making sure that's the best move we got. Yeah, okay. All right, all right. We're looking for strength? Yep. Okay. You can do it. Okay, here we go. You can do it. 19! Let's go! Yes. Oh, that's 22. <laughs> Get your ass off this gel. Set with the leg out. Got the legs hooked around her. I, I put gel. my. When I dig my. When we come my, out, can our like hair be all like? <laughs> oh, we're disgusting. It's just a muck. So yeah. I yeah. see the, the I there's feel like cracks. It's back. Yeah. My fingers are in the cracks of the floor. And oh, I have your. your... Oh yeah, you got my arm still. Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, perfect. So then we're locked. I'm pulling, I've got my legs wrapped around certain This is like all core. Yeah, yeah. and it's just a big ab workout. Just <laughs> <laughs> so, so this is gelatinous cube as home gym. Yes. Yeah. Right? Good use. Hey, look at the results. <laughs> <laughs> it's incredible. You too, could have abs like this. Yeah. Bobby, go ahead and place uh, you and certainty wherever you're next to the the lump. Oh, the lump. No, that was his action. I mean, technically, he still has a his move, right? He still has his move. So you yeah, can, so you can check out that to, hole if you want. That's what I was gonna do. Uh, but there's another thing I can do oh, yeah, for she's... certainty right now because mm-hmm. I don't have I don't mm-hmm. have cool power. Now you do risk moving away from the gelatinous cube, it making oh. a, an opportunity attack. God, suck yeah, me you, back you, in. you know what you should do? Just swing on it. Yeah, swing on I'm it. Swing yeah. on it. Fucking hit it. Yeah. Swing on it. You know, <laughs> hit, on, hit with that hot pick. Up and up in your guts. And if I don't if like you it. have a bonus action that you can use to do that, because your action is spent. Oh, this is fair. Um, well, if we if if I was resting, well, I was technically resting in there, right? Oh yeah, absolutely. <laughs> you were to be fair. <laughs> okay, yeah, I think I'm I'm all burnt up. Bobby's like um, listening to spa music in there. <laughs> uh, and yeah, you probably don't want to yeah, risk yeah. it, right? You don't want to risk it. Question. Can I, uh, I have second win. Once per short rest, you can use bonus action to regain one d10 plus two HP. Is that that something that I can use right now? Bonus action, yeah. legit. Yeah, I'll do mm-hmm. that because I can't mm-hmm. do it. I don't want to. Yeah, do yeah, just get pumped back up. Okay, boom. One d10 plus one plus two. Hell yeah, nice. Four plus two is six. Okay. It is. That's not nothing. It's a number yeah. of the beast. Yeah. Six is your fortuitous number. Is. Six is six is working. It's been good to us so far. Okay, and with that, I concede my time. <laughs> no, I yield the rest of my time to the chair. I yield my time to the chair. The cube. Uh, the ogre hasn't been hit yet. <coughs> Fresh ogre. It, uh, it has been hit by falling from the oh, ceiling. Oh, not. <laughs> yeah. uh, but otherwise, it has okay. not been hit. They look like they have the slime dealt with, so I'm going to step right in front of the ogre, and throw the cape back, oh. Whoosh. hands in front of me, I give him one of these to throw. <laughs> but I'm casting, I'm casting hideous laughter. Nice. So uh, he has to beat a wisdom thirteen, or he finds this fucking hilarious. No, but no. like in a crazy way. Yeah, he like yeah. he sees that thumb stop. come off, and he's like, "What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck?" <laughs> the, fuck? <laughs> the kind of laugh that's almost a panic attack. No, no, it yeah. is. That's what it is. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, yeah, if he does not succeed in this, he will fall prone and become incapacitated and unable to stand up for the duration 
A creature with an intelligence score of four or less isn't affected. I don't know how. I guess they shouldn't have read that part. They're too <laughs> dumb to understand the joke. I'm not sure if he's that dumb. Well, that's why I tried yeah. to make it simple, right? Yeah, like yeah. something that. So they know about thumbs. They know well, about thumbs. Yeah. How to do that, Jeremy? It, the, the magic trick, the spell, it's all top notch. Yeah, yeah. But this thing has an intelligence of three. <laughs> no! It doesn't so, understand them. It just no, drools at you. No. <laughs> this is my it, best material. It, it looks glassy-eyed at you, and just some drool oh. drips and hits the floor. That's a good All right. trick. No, no, on the shoe. <laughs> That's a hit on the shoe. That sucks. Uh, if, do I have anything in my... Oh, she's not over by me anymore. Certainty isn't. Okay. Okay. We're real pickle. Cool. Good to know. Yeah. Good to know. Yeah. I mean, that was an action, so. And now you're in melee with him. Evelyn, what do you do? I'm gonna keep hitting the cube. Well, advantage helped me at all in that, or this this thing you gave me, this magic di dice. You know. God bless it. <laughs> Dad gum it. Dad gum it. Here, no, you kill this cube. I'm trying. The lump gotta go. Two. That one probably doesn't hit. What's your total? Two plus six is eight. You hit. Hooray! Oh, I guess it is. I guess it is good. So, yeah. so to really drive home how trash its AC yeah. is, it has an AC of six. Oh, oh. okay, great. Okay. Well, I rolled a max on the die. Eight plus four for my base damage is twelve. Yeah. Plus mm. my fire damage one thirteen for my first hit. Mm. Uh, it it is a mess now. It's gone from uh, a a lump to now a sort of several lumps as it uh, it's it's, it's like, starting to break down it's breaking down <laughs> but it's not vanquished yet it is not no, one it's, more it's vanquishable oh, one more hit. hit nine on the die so you that's hit. a hit base damage of two plus four is six plus four fire damage ten you destroy it and now and, it's done and nice. there it as as it as it begins to disintegrate it you know, goes from mound to many little mounds, and then there's like, you're not sure what triggers it. It's like the outer film oh, that oh, the, holds the surface, it. the surface tension. The right? surface tension just gives, and then it just turns into this cheddar cheese smelling <laughs> li <laughs> liquid that sp splurches all over the stone oh. floor, uh, and as it flows and you can tell because of its flow that this floor is not level. Oh. Uh, some it's of already it warped. Uh, some of it flows into here. Mm -hmm. Bobby, where you sense something off. A miss. And there is a a sort of black light kind of illumination mm -hmm. uh, inside. And as that happens, Miss Ross goes, I have a new idea. <laughs> oh, no. And she, before your very eyes, sprouts another eye stalk. Huh? Oh. And, oh, no, this and, is impossibility. This is impossibility! No, 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 no. It has taken root here. And, and, sh and it has a green ribbon on it. Uh -oh. Green ribbon. <laughs> She gonna start spraying ooze juice at us out of one of the stocks? More Poison. It's a it's a cheddar ooze ray. Yeah. <laughs> Poison. <laughs> Omen, what do you do? Uh, Cer certainty is one death. No, no, no. Safe I, I, I away like from run over the big goodbye. Run over, like slide on the ground. In the cheese. Yeah, yeah. yeah through through the slop, <laughs> and I immediately like uh, unclasp the like her bag her sort of ledger bag and fish out like like as fast as i can i'm finding one of the iron vials that we mm -hmm. got from the last adventure um that the identification uh told us were potions of healing and i pop the top like like arm around her shoulder like like cradle her up and just pour it straight down her, her throat. All right, go ahead and roll the dice. Now that's a two, which, how many is that these days? <laughs> oh yeah, I just wrote down potion of healing, but we didn't know what it was. Ah, so that would be the, the potion of healing in the player's handbook. Yeah, the classic, right? I, yeah. I just forget how many D8 it is. Yeah. 
What's the baseline? Probably four of them. <laughs> so probably like eight. Four of them. Eight, four of them. eight yeah. sounds right to me. When I look last. So you're gonna roll two d four plus two. Ah, two d four. Three. That's not bad. Four. That's really not bad. So three plus four plus two is nine. <clears throat> and also, you're not dead. And also, which is really dead. the big thing. Yeah, that's the main concern. That's the key player, really. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And well, when... I don't want her to have any more ideas. Is what I'm saying. Yeah, we, we have yeah. to get the fuck out of here. What? What? I, what idea? Well, no. She... <laughs> here. No. So the. Why do I feel like I just bathed in McDonald's Sprite? <laughs> <laughs> she. She's growing new eye stalks. Just oh. she had an idea, and now she has more eyes. We have to get out. Oh. Ideas. Oh. Hope. <laughs> anyway, so that was so that was that was my turn. Okay. I mean, I guess. I mean, can you in this game? You can't do a partial move, do an action, and then continue your move. Can you? You can. I, I, you would know. Here, then I am going to go over to the slop. And once once we have had our father daughter moment, mm-hmm. I am Ooh. continuing to move over, and I just reach my hand like literally down into this grease trap and feel around for this chunk of obsidian that I hope is in there. So you you reach and it's all slimy. <clears throat> oh, that's horrible. Um, but with your dark vision, yeah. you can see that there is a, a stone-like shape, because uh, remember your dark vision is yes. uh, black and white. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and so it is a dark shape, reminiscent of the other obsidian pieces that you've gone for. Yeah. And it is just out of your reach. But the two-handed maul, that's got quite the haft. Mm. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna basically stick it in over the back of it and just drag it toward me like through the muck. So you start that, yeah, but of we'll course. see next turn. Yeah, I, I got a lot of stuff out of that <laughs> turn for sure. Uh, and at the drama of you uh, reviving certainty, uh, the skeletal audience <laughs> cheers, and Miss Ross says, "Oh, oh so heartfelt, <laughs> such <laughs> feelings." <laughs> okay, so who's next? I don't want to. I don't want to like her. Not the ogre. It's yeah. the ogre. <laughs> <laughs> well, listen now. He, there's no more gelatinous cubes to throw you into. Now there are two curtains of a flame of living flame. Yeah. That could be an issue. How much HP do you have? I have uh, probably 11. I got nine. We swings for 11, didn't we? We for like 13 last time. So, uh, Jim. Yeah. As Thanks. as it continues to look yeah, at you, no, no, no. Yeah, you're, still, you're, still, you're like, oh shit, look at my thumb, what's going on? How's that happen? Who knows? You can't do that with your thumb. Uh, as it continues to look at you with its glassy eyes, it just turns away from you. <laughs> It's like, this is not worth it. Looks directly at you, Omen. What? Fishing around no. in that culvert and charges over toward you. Jim, oh, you can Jesus. actually take an opportunity attack uh, as it barrels toward with what? Omen. Do I just hit him with my wand? You, you could slap him. <laughs> uh, give him a, just kick him. <laughs> give him a slap on the ass as he runs away. <laughs> a hard one. Yeah. Boy, I got a 19. You nice. hit. So, uh, Give him a little Christmas goose what, as he, he runs away. He, he Don't him. goose him. Yeah, so, <laughs> just two fingers. Now here's That's the not f- it. here's the funny question. What's your strength modifier? Oh, it's minus one. Oh. All right. So He's healed. You, so you deal zero damage. So it really is a good game. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> good job, buddy. Keep it up. Is this is this ogre thing naked? A uh, th- it has loincloth. sort of scraps. Yeah, I was up to my wrist. Do they get embarrassed <laughs> by being naked? Um, they must, or else they wouldn't wear this stuff. Right? That's a good point. Yeah, yeah there so must be some modesty there. Unless okay. it's like a leftover from when they were alive. <laughs> yeah, it's, oh. it could be. Yeah, oh, that's right. He is undead, too. Oh, yeah. Um, and as, as you were having this conversation <laughs> in the arena, Miss Ross says, Oh, oh we, we dress, dress them. them. We, we find. Them. Some, some contestants, contestants are too distracted, distracted. if oh, there is not <laughs> some modesty covering. Oh. <laughs> it's like a baby's arm down there. Yeah. Damn. It's Gangrenous, so yeah. He's not looking at him, but he's coming to find you. Yeah, I don't even know about it. Here, let's just, let's just get me oh. scooted farther over, just so that it is even sillier. <laughs> okay, so 
So I rolled a 19. Yeah, so Omen, <laughs> as, oh. you are, as you are desperately trying to reach the obsidian shard, uh, there is this sudden <laughs> big shadow behind <laughs> you. <laughs> and uh, the rest of you see uh, the ogre, Captain Kirk style, bring the oh. two fists down. Oh no. Oh, but, but it's very slippery over here. I'm, I'm trying to do it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's, oh, think about all the Super slime. Yeah. Oh, remember the surface tension. And he was it's charging. almost a soapy residue. Yeah. And uh, obviously, that's charging good. recklessly, I'm sure. Yeah, yeah. You, you take 13 oh. bludgeoning yeah. damage. Ah! Do you have oh, what, anything left? What did you roll? 19. 19. I did well. To, to, its total to hit was 25. Oh. Mm. 13, you said? Uh huh. Okay. Are you still conscious? Yeah. Oh, nice. Uh, and you are also slammed against the wall. So instead of being hurled into the cube, yeah. you're slammed into the wall and you fall prone. Oh. oh yeah, I mean, I already thought of myself as being prone. So, because uh. I, I thought I was like on my hands and knees, like yeah. trying to yeah. get shit out of the thing. I mean, so, if you get in there, maybe he can't follow you though. Because he's the so fantasy. big. Yeah. This is the fantasy. Mm. Just wriggle in, this there. Is get in there. Yeah, that's the yeah. yeah. It's, it's um sewer goals. You know what I mean? Certainty. What mm -hmm. do you do? I stand up. I'm very tired. <laughs> I girl. stand up. Look at Bobby. This is horrible. I know. That's what we're almost done. It's okay. <laughs> and I'm going to hope this thing is not very uh, tough. In the, <sighs> he's very big. So he's going to be easy to hit, and he's going to have a little bit of an HP pool, I think. But I'm going to try to hope him. he doesn't hit you again. So I'm going to cast great. Vicious Mockery. I don't know if he's smart enough. To do, it doesn't say that it's an, it's incumbent on their no intelligence. Yeah. Well, even so, very very dumb creatures don't like to be made fun of. Yeah. yeah. So I would say, you know, Jim thinks it's a baby's arm. I've heard it's a it's a pinky. Oh! <laughs> oh! I heard so that's you wear a, that because there's nothing down. Yeah. There. Yeah. I heard Gee, your rotten wow. pecker <laughs> rotted off years ago. Oh! <laughs> And that it's a wisdom save. Wow. Long story short, uh, wisdom save. That's. Uh... <laughs> oh, dear God. Uh, I rolled a natural twenty. <gasps> he he's thinks you're confident. wrong. He's yeah, he's like, he's like, you know what? He's like, actually, I'm he like lifts, a whore. He, he lifts the one cloth and smiles. <laughs> yes. Yes. What you and talking Omen. about, <laughs> Omen, Omen, from your vantage point, <laughs> lying on the ground at yes. its feet. Oh, no. You see just how wrong certainty no. was. <laughs> no. You see the no. shadow just over. over. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The, the shot, the shot in the show doesn't show that. We just see that silhouette. It's holding a club. No, no, the eyes, yeah, exactly. The eyes widen. Oh, All right. Okay, I was gonna try to give him disadvantage, but that's. I would mark. have loved that. Yes. Um, I mean, what's next? Uh, Bobby. And after Bobby is Jim. Um, okay, so I'm thinking of something. How, how much bigger is this ogre than I am? Uh, so you're medium and it's large. But I'm still real strong. Yeah. Did we skip you, can, me? you can wrestle him. We trying to wrestle him yeah. into this Did fire. Did we skip Evelyn? No, Evelyn's after you. Oh, okay. So. Yeah. Um. No, because throwing him into fire is going to do fire damage. But we already fire damage with our weapon. True. True. Mm -hmm. so, okay. Just beat on him. Mm. I'm going to charge him, and since he is fixated on Omen, I'm going to stab him in the side of the face. Actually, you know what? I'm not going to stab him in the side of the face. I'm going to stab him in the loincloth area. Yeah. Because <laughs> if he's going to go, he was over here uh, yeah, he's show, to... showing off to my yeah, friend. Yeah, exactly. He's flexing. That's yeah. weird. <laughs> you can flex something else. That's a very specific called shot. Yeah, it is. Well, yeah. I mean, yeah. he, he he called a shot by showing us. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> he said, here's my weak point. Negative 10. So, and it, it's flashing purple. Yeah. yeah. Like, I you have to take advantage. Since he has openly declared his weak point to us, I have advantage. Do I not? We're on our bound to strike. Yes. <laughs> Sure. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to give it to you. We're on our balance. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Boom. 14. And that's plus three. So that's 17. Or, yeah, I'll take that 17. That's a hit. Boom. Yeah. Hit. It's AC, by the way, is almost as bad as the gelatinous oh, kids. Okay. Okay. That, that, okay. That's not his advantage. His advantage is that he's tough as hell and he'll take the shit hung, out of you. Apparently. Yes. Oh, yeah. And he's also packing heat. <laughs> okay. 
horrible. Okay, here we go. So every time I roll, since I'm raged, it's plus two for every roll, right? Yep. Okay, perfect. This and then question, so my other weapons, they're not in my hand. I have one weapon in my hand, which means that's another plus two for dueling because I'm a fighter too, so it's plus four, really. Perfecto. Okay, D8. Four plus four is eight. True. I think he's right. Mm -hmm. Plus five is nine. Plus four is 13. And then plus one D6 of fire damage is two. Plus four... Oh, so the plus four is on just the whole attack. Oh, okay, dang, okay. Not on each die. Well, then I I forgot my numbers then. <laughs> oh. You had a four and a five. Four and a five. Nine plus two is 11. Then plus the four. Then yeah. plus four. So 15. 15. 15. Nice. See, we'll get there together as a Math. team. As a team. As a space team. I think I try to do the plus two on my rolls every time we play. I want you to do that. I try I to do it every time. Continue to do it. Because one of these times it's gonna go through. It's gonna slip right through. Mm -hmm. We have to be on this team. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Anyway, so that, that's that's not, that's nothing to sneeze at. Yeah. So Especially if it's such a tender region. And yes. so there there is no shadow there anymore. <gasps> oh! Oh, oh no. Well, it's and, gone. And it, uh, for the first time you see actually an expression because before just glassy, yeah. even when it fell from the ceiling and hit the floor, yeah. no expression. Uh, but, but now that you've shredded its phallus, it, <laughs> it, it, it looks just for a moment, just a look of confusion. Mm -hmm. Wouldn't anyone? And then, and yeah, then, right. Fair. And then it goes back to just totally glassy eyes. Oh, really? Yes. yes but there was a moment there. Really you got through. Okay. You got through. You say you don't, you don't do that to my, to my, any of my friends. Um. And then I'm done because I burned all my stuff because I can't rest. <laughs> yeah, we're tuckered out. I'm finished. Jim. Well, Jim. I'm gonna use catapult. I want to fling the shard into this thing's forehead. Like I want to, like catapult it out of the, the hole it's in right into this guy's face. So you unfortunately can't see it with I your human see. eyes. Oh, with my human eyes. Omen. Damn my assume. human eyes. <laughs> there must be something around here you can fling at it. I mean, the, the piece that Bobby just got. Oh, oh no. God. Oh, no. Could I? <laughs> there, <laughs> Mike is like, there is, uh, there is corpse matter on the floor. <laughs> corpse matter. <laughs> I would like to catapult it mm -hmm. directly into his face. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Like a like a sh like an arrow right between well, his eyes. Not like an arrow exactly. Yeah. Like a Well, I have to assume that when he died Rigor Mortis set in. <sighs> Absolutely. And this projectile Instantly. is Instantly. like a spear. It's rigid. I yeah. mean it's oak like. Okay. Target. 3 yeah. 4 feet long. Target. Yeah. <laughs> it's a spear essentially. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. Yeah. I would like to just javelin this prong right between his eyes. Yeah, so right. I mean, that's piercing damage, right? Oh, oh, it's gotta Lord. be. Attack, uh, save his dex, his dex thir is 13, he's gotta be 13. I bet that he does not have a good Let's dex. Let's hope he does not have a great dex. His, I'm not, he's his undead and he's an ogre. coming right at him. Uh, got a nine. Oh, we oh. weed in the face! <laughs> so how much damage does it do? His dick is gonna do 4d8 damage. <laughs> Are you kidding? No, I'm not kidding. It really was substantial. Oh, it's just oh. Catapult it does what? Catapult does 4d8 damage. Oh my god. Oh my god. You were really to... wrong about when it. When an object strikes something, the object and what it strikes each take 3d8 bludgeoning damage. So you explode that too. Yeah. Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> Three plus five is eight. Plus jack dice plus seven. Oh my 15. god. 15. 15. 15. Dick damage. <laughs> and then so it's him in the face and then it explodes in front of his face. Yes. Yes. It hits him and then yes. pops, just bursts. Yes. So so as 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 that corpse I, I just matter. To apologize. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I, I, I thought I was inviting you here for a different purpose. Yeah. Nope. We're filming pornography. <laughs> My parents aren't watching this one. You know Miss Ross loves this. Oh, no, oh she's yeah. yeah. She's getting cringe. She loves it. She's going to grow probably. another eye. She's never seen she anything That's like gonna this. going to be bad. We she, don't want to see this Ray. We're no. going straight to the Yum 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 yes. after this. Yum 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 Yes. And, uh, when you think of Miss Ross, um, you, you, so as this happens, and the glassy eyed zombie actually sheds a single tear. Oh, can we imagine? Oh. It's dealing with some shit. Yeah. Um, uh, 
Miss Ross with apparently an eye socket that she must have sprout at some other point that is down below, mm -hmm. reaches around. It's an eye socket, by the way, that has the eye, but then a hand and it has a monocle. Oh my God. Uh, and as this is, and as this is going on, she is, she is watching. Oh, it's a better look. Dude, yes. The impossibility factor of this place yeah. is through the fucking yeah. roof. Yeah, yeah. It's a lot of impossibility That's a wild ride. happening. Yeah. And, and she is now right there. Like, I don't want to miss a place. She's going on there. The skeletons behind her are like, yeah. Yeah. Like we, paid for these, we paid for these seats. <laughs> 400 gold, whatever. Evil, Evelyn, your turn. Okay, I'm little, so, <coughs> so I want to fly up and like perch on his back. Oh. That wow. worked way better. Yeah, than yeah, that. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Um, and I want to take my battle axe and hold either side of it and press my feet against oh his shoulders God. and yes. the battle axe into his neck. Wow, that got, mm -hmm. that Jesus. got dark. I got to put him out of his misery, yeah. man. Quick. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what do I roll for that? Around. Uh, yeah. Go ahead and do a strength athletics, and you have advantage for flying up there. And it's pretty in, surprising. In, for how yes. I balance my mini, yeah. first yes. try. All right, first roll is a 13. That was almost a one, that was really scary. And a 13, mm, two 13s, plus mm -hmm. my strength check. Athletics. Uh, strength athletics, mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh. plus four, so 17. You, mm -hmm. you are successful, and now go ahead and roll your weapon's damage. Uh, it's an ax, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, just so instead of doing the normal slashing damage, uh, you can do it as bludgeoning damage as essentially you okay. try to mm -hmm. choke it out. Cool. Uh, one plus four is five plus my fire that's on the axe oh, yes. mm -hmm. is five. What did I just say? Five and five. Ten. Yeah. Uh, there is a kind of uh, choking sound. Makes uh, sense. But it is still alive. That is technically a melee attack. So do I get to... Pull it again. Yeah. Cool. Two attacks, right? Mm. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Dark Evelyn. Yeah. It's a big turn. Do I need to roll for it? Yeah. Okay, well, I have advantage, right? Because I'm already mm -hmm. here. Okay, cool. Good, because that was fine. <laughs> That's even well, worse. five oh, plus no. six is 11. You hit. Wait, wait, okay, great. His, his, great, his AC is like yeah. It's trash, trash AC yeah. is eight. Yeah. All right. He's going through a lot right now. Base damage <laughs> is. He's healing <laughs> yeah. yeah, he really is. Base damage is two plus four is. Uh, six plus a d6, which is three, is nine. All right, Evelyn, as you do this, and uh, that single tear now drops off its chin. And sizzles in the fire. Its, its glassy eyes just darken, and it falls down dead. Oh. Be, be in the light, be in the light. <laughs> Go free. And and at this, the crowd erupts oh, in yeah. applause. We're giving them something special. Yeah. And uh, Miss Ross throws the monocle down on the ground and brings out from behind her another eye stock hand, and <laughs> she she applauds uh, and says, "That, that was one, one of the best rounds I've seen in weeks." <laughs> Yum yums. You have earned. A stay in the yum yum room. And at this, all of her eyes, including the ones on her hands, all blink, uh, and the fires wink out, as does the force field uh, that you could see on the upper part of the ring. I think that if there's any chance we could rest before we grab yeah. the obsidian, then we should try to take it. What obsidian are you talking about? I didn't say, I said uh, citizen. Before we gra grab another citizen like this one uh, and murder them for your entertainment. And, I'm, and, I, and I nod, I'm like, mm, yeah, that's definitely a real Evelyn thing. finds herself lying and does not know what's happening. Yeah, she's, she's hung out with she's Omen staying, too she's long. choking them out yeah. and then she's cutting them and shit. She's going crazy. Well, well you, you did, did so well. well. I might have you skip round two after the yum yum room and go straight to round three. That sounds great. Awesome. And, and, Love that. and fight my sister. Oh, That's amazing. Oh, what's her name? Miss Daisy. Oh. 
Oh, does okay. she need a driver? Hopefully she's as kind. <laughs> <as you're laughs> Which of these rooms is the yum yum room, ma'am? Yeah. Right, right over here. here. And she indicates this room. Right above. Here, here, here. I kick in the door of the yum yum room. Wave in the four four. In here. Hey, we got it. We got it. Here, no. We would love to go in the yum yum room. We would yeah, love. No, to exactly. No, no. It's like mm -hmm. I make a big play of it down yeah. here. Like I need. I say certainly. I, I'm not as young as I used to be. I kind of need some help. No, oh, yeah. Getting up, I'm like. Ugh, oh, ugh, oh! Did you, if you fall in, you need help getting and I'm up. Like, I'm like, open your bag. I open my bag. And I finish scooping the. You don't want to grab it yet. No, because no, 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 no one's gonna touch it. Okay. We're just gonna put it in the bag. But also, we can tunnel it down. Uh huh. The yum yum room. Uh huh. Yeah. I say, oh God, thanks. I know I'm an I'm an old man. You know, I mm -hmm. really appreciate you put this in the bag. Scoop it into the bag, seal up the top, uh, and then we will get up. If we can get away with it, we'll see. Mm -hmm. uh, go ahead. I'm ready for performance. Go ahead and do a charisma performance check. I, I I thought you'd never ask. Are you also doing magic right now? What is it no, I'm just checking out the yum yum room. I don't even know what's in here. <laughs> yeah. Oh. My back. <laughs> Nineteen plus three. Oh, wow. mm. Okay. So your your performance is very convincing, and uh, rather than responding to you moving the obsidian chunk, in fact, you're not sure if Miss Ross noticed at all. Uh, she instead says, "I think one of the tea cakes in the yum yum room might help your back. You'll want to be in fighting shape before you face my sister." Yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Let's get those tea, tea cakes. cakes. Mm. Yeah. Oh. CBD. So I love uh, a scone. Absolutely. I'm into it. I say this is exactly what I mean. I make a I make a mm -hmm. effort to climb up here, but I'm gonna go up these stairs, and then I gotta like step over these boxes and crates <laughs> and bags. Like it's a big production, but then I finally get into the yum yum, and it feels it feels right. Mm -hmm. What's in here? So. As you can see, there is a table, and then there are cushions on the ground. And uh, Miss Ross, <laughs> she's oh, so funny. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, yeah. no, we can't even like see her fully through the doorway. No, no. you cannot. Okay, just an eye. Uh, yeah, she she looks in and says, "Now, would you like to eat first? Or would you like to nap? Nap. Ooh. Nap. Nap. Well, then everyone close your eyes. And I have to remember, it's it's the orange one, not the purple one. Oh, we're just, we're just gonna relax. You know, I'm pretty tired. I could probably fall asleep. Yeah, I don't even need any peace. Alone. We'll Thank be, you. Yeah, we'll yeah. I don't, don't worry about it. And before you can get the door shut, um, <laughs> it was she, a nice try. Grizzly it light was a nice floods try. the room. So she she blasts two rays at once. There is the oh, orange combo. ray from her head, and then one of her hand rays also fires at the table, and. When the ray hits the table, a huge buffet of dessert oh, yeah. appears. You see tea cakes, scones, oh. it, what looks to be an ice cream cake that's in the shape of an otiag. Oh, croissant. Uh, you see almond croissants. Mm -hmm. Chocolat, a pan of chocolat. Mm. It's all there, including a chocolate fountain. Oh, oh I love it. Mm. And as you see all that, the other ray hits you, and you fall fast asleep. Oh. Ray, long rest, short rest, and hopefully it'll be. Hopefully we'll be able to get some snack back. Yeah. You have all of you that that feeling of waking up, but it's like really hard to move. It's almost like a, like, like sleep paralysis. Sleep paralysis. <laughs> And crouched up on the table, and the door is closed. So now, no sign of Miss Ross. I miss her. Yeah. Uh, you see, uh, crouched up on the table with his rosy cheeks, Archie. <gasps> oh. 
Really? Hello there. Hey, buddy. Hi. I was in a different part of this place. Hmm. And I could hear you through the walls. I think you might be asleep right now. <laughs> and we are. We have consulted with each other, and we think you need to get out of there as quickly <laughs> as possible. For we believe the level that you are on is entirely drenched with impossibility. Yes. Oh. And if you stay there much longer, you will start being transformed by it. Okay. Understood. Let's Understood. wake up. I need everyone to make a wisdom saving throw. I'm going to use my inspiration on this one. Good idea. Good idea, because I just rolled a one. I rolled a two. We are not uh, I also <laughs> rolled a two, but I have inspiration. Ah, so that's a 21. All right, so nine plus four, so 13. 15? All right, so... Only Certainty and Jim wake up. Huh. However, all of you have the benefits of a long rest. <gasps> yes. oh, I've never hey. been so happy to Thank rest. Hey, Thander. A long rest. Confirm that Boom. long rest. That feels good. You see, your three friends are still asleep and the door is now open, and Miss Ross uh, is hovering there at the open door. Expected. And uh, her two sprouted hands are apparently stretch really far, and she is starting to pull Omen toward her wide open mouth. Oh my God! What? And, and and she goes. This is the best part of the yum yum room. Oh, where are the yum yums? Okay. Oh. Okay. We just gotta touch that rock. Yeah, touch yo. that rock. You got it. You're the only awake. Yeah. We'll yeah. Go. Well, he's awake too. I'm awake. Are you, I'm awake. Okay. It's your rock. You have it. You have it. You touch the rock. Yes. Yes. I'm gonna touch the rock. As I'm touching the rock, it doesn't say this requires a, an rock. action. It says no action. Can I use my portent? So we, since we just finished a long rest. Yes. I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna see, but I wanna. Yeah, but let's 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 start. Okay. Let's start so one's a fifteen. Up, that's a good one. Let's start these numbers. And okay, so that's two fifteens. That's good. Those two are both good, solid, rock, dice solid dice rolls. Yeah. They can swap in for anything. Yes. Okay. <clears throat> so, I get a brief glimpse of the future. Now, as a point of order, <laughs> our other DM, Chris Perkins, said that when Certainty uses portent in Greyhawk, she sees a flash of the future. And in fact, you do. Ah. Mm. <laughs> uh, you, you see a city made entirely of iron, spires that reach up toward an ashen sky where comets of fire hurl down to the ground and hit. And in your vision, you move into the City of Iron, going among its streets that are filled from one side of the street to the other with devils. And as your vision goes over them, you go into the central spire of the city. And there, in a vast chamber, you see this handsome, devil with great horns, wearing a red robe, and holding a rod capped by a massive glimmering ruby. ruby. And hovering in front of him is this huge angelic figure, white wings, uh, a halo over its head that is so bright that you cannot see its holy face. And you see the devil lay his rod down at the foot of the angel and you hear him say the words, I am ready to go home. <gasps> and that's where your vision stops. So that's pretty impossible. That's pretty impossible. That's impossible. 
That's pretty impossible. That's what he's afraid of. That universe. Mm-hmm. That mm -hmm. world. No, that's the that's the future. Yeah. What's well, one of them? Unless we unless we yeah. stop it. This like is we're good. talking about <laughs> Asmodeus fell Relenting. from the heavens underneath his beautiful robes is bleeding and from his blood all devils are born type of lord yeah. of hell's bitch yeah. this is some the, the this is some sandman who's going to own hell once no, i'm this, gone this cuz i'm the out whole, lucifer type of shit no, this rewrites this is, the multiverse it's a pretty big deal and who that angel yeah hmm. okay i don't have time to think about that <laughs> I'm just like, yeah, I'm yeah, just yeah. like, so then, oh, so God. Yeah, yeah, that happened, yeah. And I grab the rock. And as you do so, uh, there is that ringing, even in your sleepers, in your dreams, oh. you hear that ringing and you are suddenly whisked away and you can all just hear a distant voice that goes, oh, <laughs> there go my yum yums. <laughs>